Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to fall 2022 commencement for Arkansas Tech University. This time, Dr. Sean Reed, Chair of the Faculty Senate, will present the University Mace. The Mace is an ancient symbol of authority. At Arkansas Tech University, it represents the enduring tradition of learning. The Mace is present at official ceremonies of importance attended by the Board of Trustees and the University President. Please welcome the faculty of Arkansas Tech University. Arkansas Tech University proudly presents the class of 2022.
Now entering the arena floor, the officers of administration, the Arkansas Tech University Board of Trustees, and President Dr. Robin E. Bowen. Good morning. Please be seated. Honored guests, graduates, faculty, 
administrators, staff members, ladies and gentlemen, I hereby convene these commencement exercises marking the 112th year of Arkansas Tech University and celebrating the achievements of the fall 2022 graduating class. My name is Julie Firstbovey. I serve as the Interim Vice President for Academic Affairs, and it is my distinct pleasure to welcome you to our campus. To begin our ceremony this morning, the ATU Reserve Officer Training Corps will present the colors. This will be followed by the singing of our national anthem, led by Holly Ruth Gale, Associate Professor of Music. Please stand as you are able. Please be seated. Now we would like to introduce the members of our platform party. Platform party members, please rise as I call your name. First, the Board of Trustees of Arkansas Tech University. Representing our board today are Mr. Len Cotton, Board Secretary, and Mr. Michael Lamoro. Ladies and gentlemen, please express your appreciation for our Board of Trustees. Also on the platform this morning are the officers of administration of our university. Please hold your applause until each can be introduced. Party members, please rise as I call your name. Dr. Robin E. Bowen, President. Mr. Bruce Sykes, Chancellor, Ozark Campus. Dr. Mary Gunter, Chief of Staff. Ms. Lori Fiorello, Vice President for Administration and Finance. Dr. Keegan Nichols, Vice President for Student Affairs. Mr. Jason Geiken, Vice President for Advancement. Mr. Edward Armstrong, University Council. 
Ms. Abby Davis, Athletics Director. Other members of our official party include Dr. Jeffrey Cass, Dean of the College of Arts and Humanities, Dr. Russ Jones, Dean of the College of Business and Economic Development, Ms. Tammy Weavar, Registrar, Dr. Sean Reed, Faculty Senate Chair, Ms. Kim McGowan, Staff Senate Chair, and I would like to recognize the first gentleman of Arkansas Tech, Mr. Doug Bowen. Please join me in welcoming our platform party. Universities are known by the work and reputation of their faculty, and the accomplishments of the class of 2022 are possible through their efforts. Our faculty are a hardworking and dedicated group of men and women. They are teachers and scholars who have guided our candidates through their academic journey to this proud day of graduation. We are so proud of the excellence of our faculty members. One of our colleagues will retire from the faculty today. For her dedicated service to our students and our university, we would like to recognize Mrs. Holly Ruth Gale, Associate Professor of Music. Holly, please stand so we may recognize you, congratulate you, and thank you. At this time, we wish to recognize two groups of students for outstanding achievement, exemplifying the long and proud tradition at Arkansas Tech. First, we'll recognize those students in the Honors Program. These students are selected on a competitive basis and are required to enroll in a sequence of Honors courses in addition to the courses required for their majors. Only students who successfully complete all requirements can graduate from the Honors Program. Our honors graduates wear a distinctive honors medallion. Honors program graduates, please stand when your name is called. Ladies and gentlemen, please hold your applause until all of the students have been recognized. Tyler Scott Bell. Adam Russell Chaston. Kiera Klein. Sarah Catherine Smith. Griffin. Henley Williams. Please join me in recognizing these University Honors Program graduates. The second group we wish to recognize are those students who have earned academic honors. All graduates who have earned a cumulative grade point average of 3.5 to 3.699 earn the distinction of cum laude. Those with a 3.7 to 3.899 earn the distinction magna cum laude. And those with a 3.9 to 4.0 earn the distinction summa cum laude. These honor graduates may be recognized by the gold cords on their academic regalia and their names are listed in your programs. Honors graduates, Please rise so we may salute your accomplishments. You may be seated. <laughs> a tradition keeper is a student who has enriched the value of their student experience at Arkansas Tech through their involvement in extracurricular activities. These students are chosen based upon their campus involvement, their leadership, and other accomplishments. They are designated by the green recognition cords over their robes. Tradition keepers, please stand so we may recognize you. You may be seated. At this time, it is my pleasure to welcome the 12th president of Arkansas Tech University, Dr. Robin E. Bowen. <laughs> we
we now recognize and confer posthumous honoris causa degrees to individuals who were degree-seeking students at Arkansas Tech University at the time of their passing. Today and at each December commencement ceremony, we pause for a solemn tribute to the dedication and academic aspirations of these students. In front of the stage are empty chairs draped in white. These chairs remind us of our recently lost students whose memories live on here at Arkansas Tech and in the hearts of their loved ones. Arkansas Tech University extends its sincere condolences to the families of these honorary degree recipients and joins in celebrating their achievements. Dr. First Bovey, could you please join me at the podium for the awarding of these degrees? Could the family members please come forward as your honoree is introduced? Jesse Shane Boshears. Justin Alexander Riley. Gabrielle Lynn Hill. Cade Manning Lane. Joshua Daniel Malagon.
and Mary Catherine Hullam. Thank you for joining us in honoring these students and their family members. Let's now take a moment of silence to remember these students. Thank you. Now please join me in welcoming President Bowen back to our podium. Well, good morning, and thank you for joining us here today. Arkansas Tech has a long and distinguished history, but I'm going to share the short version. It's a story that dates back to April 1st, 1909, when Governor George Donaghy signed legislation establishing the second district agricultural school. We became Arkansas Polytechnic College in 1925, and our name was changed to Arkansas Tech University in 1976. ATU continued to grow in 2003 when the campus formerly known as the Arkansas Valley Technical Institute became Arkansas Tech University Ozark Campus, a separate location, but all one university. The first graduating class at Arkansas Tech had 11 students in 1912. They were our first alumni. Today, Arkansas Tech University has almost 10,000 students and more than 50,000 alumni across the world. After the ceremony today, those of you in front of me will be among our alumni. While many things have changed at Arkansas Tech since that first graduation ceremony, some things have stayed the same. Like those first students, you arrived at Arkansas Tech maybe knowing a few people, maybe no one. But each of you has met new people and forged friendships that will last a lifetime. But first and foremost, each of you completed a plan of study, culminating in a degree. This process was facilitated by excellent faculty who challenged you, but also supported you in your intellectual growth and guided you in your chosen field of study. By graduating today, you are joining an elite group. Those of you getting a bachelor's degree, less than 7% of the world's population has a bachelor's degree. Only 9% of the U.S. population, the U.S. population, has attained a master's degree or higher. What each of you has done is a commendable achievement. If there's any group that's demonstrated the grit and determination necessary to keep moving forward, no matter how difficult the circumstances, it is the class of 2022. 
I will forever remember the resilience that you displayed during the COVID-19 pandemic. You are simply amazing. Graduates, I ask that you raise your hand to indicate if you received a scholarship, any scholarship, while a student here at Arkansas Tech. Put those arms up high, and now look around at how many hands are up. Thank you. <laughs> Remember that a significant percentage of those scholarships came from donors. Some donors have the ability to make large gifts, endowing scholarships on their own. But a large number of the scholarships are put together, with $10 from here and $50 from there. Donors who, without even knowing you, wanted to give you a better life. They wanted to give you this opportunity. Raise your hand if you worked while attending tech. Now leave your hand up if you work full time. Thank you. If you cared for a family member or children while at Tech, please raise your hand. <laughs> Students, all of you, think about all that you have achieved despite all of the obstacles. As I said earlier, you are truly amazing. The benefits of an Arkansas Tech experience will carry on for the remainder of your life. The most recent data suggests that the lifetime earnings, the gap between individuals who stop their education after high school graduation and those who go on to earn a bachelor's degree is on average $31,200 per year. Over your lifetime, that's an average of $1.2 million more that you will receive. Also, your financial security is enhanced by a college education. Only 2.3% of bachelor degree graduates in the U.S. are unemployed. In addition to the financial rewards of an education, you and your children are more likely to live longer and healthier lives if you graduate from college. You are also more likely to have a career that will afford you benefits, such as health insurance, a retirement plan, and paid time off. There's another issue to consider. The private good of higher education is obvious. The private good being the good to the individual who's getting the degree. But what is the public good for higher education? What's the gain to society? Why should government invest in higher education and make it accessible to all? Well, there are many reasons. People who graduate from college are more likely to volunteer, they're more likely to vote. I could go on and on. But the answer, in terms of dollars and cents, is that college graduates, on whole, pay far more in taxes and require less government assistance than those who stop their education after a high school graduation. That average gap is $355,000 average net gain to society between taxes paid and government expenditures for a high school graduate. Excuse me. The difference is $355,000. For a high school graduate, they pay a difference in taxes and government assistance, a net of $26,000. The average net gain to society between taxes paid and government expenditures for a college graduate is $381,000. Now just think about that for a moment. As we increase the number of Arkansans with a bachelor's degree by only 1,000, 
That would be an additional $355 million in revenue that we would have for roads, schools, and all the other services that we need. Higher education is a public good and a private good. We can't treat it as a luxury reserved for a few. It must be viewed as an accessible necessity for the growth and development of our communities and our nation. Students, as you go forth, find your passion. Be it creating technologies to feed hungry people any corner of the world, educating students, providing health care services, discovering the next generation of energy sources, whatever your passion, find your place and make your mark. For generations, Arkansas Tech University graduates have used the knowledge that they gained here to make the world a better place, and they have represented the university well. I know that each and every one of you will do the same. Congratulations and good luck. And now, what you've all been waiting for, Dr. First Bovey, please join me at the podium for the awarding of conferred degrees. This commencement ceremony includes candidates for the bachelor's degree, associate degree, technical certificate, and advanced certificate. Candidates, when the name of the degree that you will receive is called, please stand for the conferring of your degree. First, will the candidates for the bachelor's degree please rise? President Bowen, these candidates have met all of the graduation requirements for the Bachelor of Arts, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Bachelor of Music Education, Bachelor of Science, and Bachelor of Science in Business Administration. On behalf of our faculty, I recommend them for the bachelor's degree. Under the authority granted to me by the Board of Trustees in the state of Arkansas, I hereby confer on you the bachelor's degree with all of the rights, privileges, and duties pertaining thereto. You may be seated. Will the candidates for the associate degree please rise? President Bowen, these candidates have met all of the graduation requirements for the Associate of Applied Science, Associate of Arts, Associate of Business Administration, Associate of General Studies, and Associate of Science. On behalf of the faculty members, I recommend them for their associate degrees. Under the authority granted to me by the Board of Trustees in the state of Arkansas, I hereby confer on you the associate's degree with all of the rights, privileges, and duties pertaining thereto. Yes, you may be seated. Will the candidates for technical certificates please rise? President Bowen, these candidates have met all of the graduation requirements for their technical certificates. On behalf of the faculty members, I recommend them for the technical certificate. Under the authority granted to me by the Board of Trustees and the State of Arkansas, I hereby confer on you the technical certificate with all of the rights, 
privileges and duties pertaining thereto. You may be seated. And now, will the candidates for the advanced certificates please rise? <laughs> President Bowen, this candidate has met all of the graduation requirements for the advanced certificate. On behalf of the faculty, I recommend him for the advanced certificate. Under the authority granted to me by the Board of Trustees and the, aid of, and the State of Arkansas, I hereby confer literally on you the advanced <laughs> certificate with all of the rights, privileges, and duties pertaining thereto. And now all of our candidates will be presented by the deans or chancellor of their college. Tiffany Lynn Bailey. Kristen Darlene Baker. Elizabeth Danielle Bankhead. Sarah Elizabeth Belk. Zoe Ann Comstock. <laughs> Holland Faith Davis. <laughs> Chloe Elizabeth Ellis. Reese Green. <laughs> Laura Sahara Hauk. <laughs> Morgan Hayes. Cassidy Noel Hemphill. <laughs> Heather Brooke Hudson. <laughs> Shelby Lynn Kelly. Madeline Grace Leach. Byron Edward McIntosh. Abigail McKissick. Rachel Lorraine Moore. Kimberlyn Janae Olson. Chloe Nicole Oxford.
Sandra Elizabeth Peña Palacios. Brooke Anna Rose Pulliam. Garnett Wade Russell. Braley Dawn Simmons. Devion Isaiah Smith. <laughs> Drew Allen Suggs. <laughs> Rhiannon Alexis Swaim. Abby May Wagner. <laughs> Addison Ann Devane. <laughs> Kendall Jean Grace Atkinson. Si Ying Chen. <laughs> Tennyson Lorena Douglas. <laughs> Isaac Nicholas Garrett Evans. Maxwell Foster. Jacqueline Page Labeth. CJ Peng. Tyler Chance Swain. <laughs> Haley Rena Webb. <laughs> Jiming Zhang. Gilbert Guatemoc Arizaga. <laughs> Kai Elliot Beck. <laughs> Tyler Bell. Leticia Cardoso Fraga. Jersey Nicole Few. Linda Michelle Flores. Rebecca Ellen McIntyre. <laughs> Vanessa Hernandez Perez. <laughs> Yu 
Jace Borden Bynan. Catherine Michelle Bonilla Beltran. Hayden Robert Breving. George Andrew Curtin. Braden N. Downham. Ethan Lee Harris. Zachary Davis Holt. William Grant, Alexander Larson. Yeah! Calvin Wyatt Ramsey. <laughs> Ethan George Rocker. Timothy Robert Thomas. <laughs> Jacob Tanner Hawkins. <laughs> Sorry. James Edward Heffington. Hayden Alexander Holt. <laughs> Nicholas Howell. Robert Thomas Johnson. Ashley Marin. Yeah. Jayu Mo. <laughs> Jessica Yvonne Prophet. Jasmine Romero. Kirsten Catherine Diane Ross. Griffin Henley Williams. Le Shuan Zhu. Anna Lynn Brown. William Darrell Brown. Russell Chastain. Yeah. 
son, Walter Collins. <laughs> Isaac Brody Deaver. Katie Elizabeth Garrett. <laughs> Michaela Nicole Hayes. <laughs> Cheyenne Nicole Honeycutt. Logan Robert Jones. Kiara Klein. Dason Daniel Lee. Douglas Alexander Messick. Cameron Taylor Osborne. Guadalupe Reese. Jimmy Glenn Ryan. Katie Melissa Rodriguez. Sarah Catherine Smith. <laughs> Piper Neely Turner. <laughs> Jacob Tyler Webb. Nayeli Gabriela Aguillon Escoto. <laughs> Nasser Al Ganoum. <laughs> Kishana Yanis Brown. Kendra Faith Campbell. Lizbeth Catalan. Kevin Charles Foster. Maria Grace Franks. Caitlin Gitter. Woo! 
Stormy Hampton. Ethan William Hayes. Olivia Christine Hopkins. Chelsea Leanne Johnson. Cassidy Leanne LaRue. Tessa Lynn Reynolds. Elizabeth Blair Riney. Hope Madison Sparks. Cammie Brooke Turner. Ty Legarius Mickle Whitfield. Erica Renee Arndt. Atalanta Page Baker. Woo! Joey Elizabeth Bogert. Hadley L. Brown. Zachary Burrow. Grayson Cauley. Autumn Page Flattery. Tristan Rhett Harbor. Marissa Deshay Hammonds. Aviri Renee Henley. Micah K. Coach. Let's go, Rebecca! Rebecca Marianne Lee. <laughs> Lily C. Mayrick. Abigail Faith McFarlane. Yeah. 
Joshua Pierce. Peyton Reynolds. Taylor Danielle Schultz. Abigail Rose Scott. Madison May Vanderkoy. Kenley Jones Wallace. Christopher Thomas Wilson. Quade B. Wilson. Jamulet Aguilar. Let's go, Bryson. Kaylee Nicole Boone. Madison Kayla Breedlove. Devin LaTroy Burns. <laughs> Jay Darren Craft. <laughs> Baylor Andrew Cresilius. Bryson Allen Kinsey George. <laughs> Trey Wyatt Haley. <laughs> Eli Hallbaker. Alexis Hernandez. <laughs> Brittany Nicole Hollis. <laughs> Mingling who? Brandon Damal Hunter. <laughs> Alexis Kazire. <laughs> Alexis Larinaga. Diane Lee. Easy, Easy Lou. <laughs> K. 
Kelsey Jade Matson. Jessica Lynn Miller. Braden Anthony Mitchell. Vary de Owen Onofre Mendez. Ashley Carol Reed. Hector Daniel Sarit Cohen. Jacob Dylan Six. <laughs> Aspen Nicole Smith. <laughs> Hannah Lee Smith. Jefferson Antonio Solis Matut. <laughs> Taj Armani Spite. <laughs> Skip Lemuel Standridge. Rose Tina Harrow. Ryan Paul Tyrell. Parker Allen Ward. Catherine Riley Whitfield. Sarah L. Yarberry. John J. Yi. Ying Zing Win. Ben Yen Zhong. Connor Isaac Johnson. Alexander Lewis King. Harley Don Hightower.
Megan Elizabeth Martin. Daniela Sanchez. Alicia Marie Combs. Roberta Friend. Susan Burr. Anthony Quinn Fish. David Guona. Christopher Tyler Robinson. Eric Ross Wilhite. Riley Wayne Williams. Catherine Elise Edwards. Katina Lynn Kimberling. Alexa Christina Tula. Camila Don Bass. Jasmine Crouch. Zachary Keith Dawson. Skyler Bree Andrews Zabel. Emma Catherine Barker. Amanda Beeson. Jessica Lynn Burchett. Megan Brooke Chance. Jacelyn Olivia Dooley. Alicia Kathleen Henson. <laughs> Catherine Suzanne Pony. <laughs> Christina Marie Flieger.
Guadalupe Martinez. Bailey Faith King. Kyler Eldon O'Brien. Brandy Valen Stafford. Kelsey Tamara Walker. Kaylee Woodall. Lewis Michael Wayman Alexander. Lydia Montana Lukens. Scott Schmidt. Isaiah Jordan Sheppy. Cody Mark Wiesman. Michelle Alvarado. <laughs> Lindsay Rebecca Bastion. Lacey Nicole Buchanan. Kaylee Swain Catlett. Nicole Marie Hamrick. Alexis Nicole Hatcher. Carly Don Ingram. Anna Johnson. Sierra Nichelle King. Vanessa Lynn Kisler. Alexis Ray Lee. Judy Beth McGuire. Jamie Elizabeth Mills. Martha Ann Newmeyer. Amber Elaine Smalling. Jacob Andrew Brockman. Brady Job Watson. Erica Michelle Aguera 
Segovia. <laughs> Dustin Keith Cargow. Joshua Daniel Ham. Allison Danielle Johnson. Rasha Don Picton. Frank Smith. Jackson Harris. Austin Swain. Genevieve Teresa Furtado. <laughs> Peyton Pruitt. Rain Vaughn. Bailey Marie Faircloud. Dylan Miller. Brandon Hunter Raglan. Yamilet de Jesus Gallego, excuse me, Gallegos. <laughs> Brittany Marie Sluderman. Jamie Lynn also Rachel Nicole Ray Hope Leanne Spears Catherine Marie White. Let's have a big congratulations for all of our graduates.
Each of you who graduated today was here as a result of dreams that you shared, shared with your parents, your families, your friends. Many have offered you encouragement, made sacrifices, pointed the way, and helped bring you to this milestone in your lives. I hope that each and every one of you take the time and opportunity to thank these individuals today. We at Arkansas Tech recognize that you would not be successful without considerable help along the way, and we want to show our appreciation. Could the parents, grandparents, spouses, partners, children, friends, and other supporters of our graduates please stand and be recognized? Thank you. You may be seated. Speaking of the accomplishments of the class of 2022, they also wouldn't be here today if it weren't for the encouragement and guidance of their teachers, teachers advisors, coaches, counselors, and others. Would all of the teachers, coaches, counselors, principals, and anyone else who works in our state's education system please stand? We express our gratitude to these women and men and thank them for all that they do for our great state. A few more thank yous to the Arkansas Tech Presidential Leadership Cabinet for serving as ushers today. Thank you. I also want to thank members of the Commencement Committee who spent long hours planning the event today. Could members of the Commencement Committee please stand and be recognized? And also, very sincere appreciation is extended to the Arkansas Tech University Symphonic Wind Ensemble under the direction of Dr. Dan Belangia, Professor of Music and Director of Bands. <laughs> Finally, we owe an incredible debt of gratitude to the men and women of our, our armed forces. I ask that all of our veterans please rise and receive our recognition. Thank you. And now it is my pleasure to introduce Cody Black, class of 2003, to welcome you to the ATU Alumni Association. The Arkansas Tech Alumni Association and Board would like to congratulate you on reaching the academic achievement. We welcome you into the Alumni Association today and add your names to the list of more than 55,000 alumni who are making an impact in different professional fields throughout the world. As a new alumni member, I would ask you to do a few simple things. Number one, help the alma mater remain strong by recruiting outstanding students such as yourself. This can be done in so many simple acts of encouragement throughout your daily lives. Remember, you are our number one advocate. Second, fly the tech flag. Blast the green and gold. Display your diploma in your office or your home. Wear your ATU apparel. Get an ATU license plate or place a tech flag in your yard. Let people know who you are and where you're from. Number three, always stay connected and be involved. I encourage each of you to participate in homecoming, attend alumni networking events, join a university advisory board. The people you have met here at Arkansas Tech will always remain your confidants. Utilize this group of peers, the university, 
and the relationships you have formed to enhance your careers and enrich your lives. And lastly, continue to support the university through your time, your talent, your energy, and your resources. Keeping our alma mater robust through a culmination of these actions will enable us to uphold the rich heritage, tradition, mission, and vision of Arkansas Tech University. To the class of 2022, congratulations. A new chapter, a new chapter in life has just begun. You have gained something that no one can ever take away. Embrace and relish in your accomplishment and enjoy your graduation. Welcome to the ATU alumni family. Thank you, Mr. Black. Members of the class of 22, please rise. I ask that you move your tassels from the right to the left in honor of your receipt of a university degree. Congratulations, graduates. Please remain standing as Samuel Holtkamp and retiring Associate Professor Holly Ruth Gale lead us in singing the Arkansas Tech University alma mater. And if we have alums in the audience, please rise and sing with us too. You may be seated. In honor of our graduates, we ask that all guests remain in your seat until the platform party and the graduates have recessed the building. Your graduate will greet you in front of the Coliseum following our recessional. Again, congratulations to all of our graduates. Good luck. I now declare the fall 2022 commencement closed. Thank you.
Thank you.